Hello and welcome again back to VW Feast. Today we're going to, by popular request, potato and pea curry. This is one of our favourites and very, very healthy. Use up all those potatoes that you've had lying around, chopped tomatoes, frozen peas because who do use fresh peas? And all the other spices that are listed in the ingredients below. Actually, this is a request of Jeremy and Justin who wanted this one. They liked it so much they said we should make a video of it. I think there exists an egg curry as well, but I'm not quite brave enough for that one. First of all, heat up some oil in a hot pan and add your spices. Just let those fry for a little bit in the oil. And then you want to add the potatoes. Now it's important that you drain the potatoes and get all the water off them, especially if you've been keeping them. If not, this happens. Woohoo! That's scary little bubbles of steam spitting the oil out. What you probably want to do there is just cover it. Stop the oil spitting everywhere and just turn the temperature down a bit. So now we've got safety back again, let's just gently fry those potatoes. Ultimately you want to keep a little bit of al dente but just a little bit of crunch to these. So. You've got the texture of the potatoes, you don't want something that's going to go into mash. But also you don't really want roast potatoes either. That'd be quite weird. Curried roast potatoes? Oh well. So, to the potatoes, we get them until they're just a bit softened. A little bit crunchier. Crispy on the outside, but as I said, not roast potatoes. And in our spices, this again is the stage where you want to stir quickly, otherwise you're going to get an entire lungful of mustard gas. Now add your peas. Stir everything through again. And just a little bit of water. So now really everything's going to boil rather than fry. And I'll leave that to cook. Okay. That's one track now. About 10 minutes. After that we're going to add in our chopped tomatoes. So making sure that we taste and season as needed. This really is a very simple curry, but the textures and the flavours, it's always a favourite at our table. Bring those through, we don't want to get to the stage where the tomatoes start falling apart, just to gently pull them through. And then serve either as a side or as a main. So there we have it. Potato and pea curry. One of our favourites. Hope you like it too. Enjoy. 